if you are a data engineer and looking for the change then this video is very important for you today i'm going to discuss about the data engineering interview question which might get asked in your upcoming interview so i used to bring videos like this regularly if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe and share with your friend whoever into the data engineering field so like the question is we have to write an sql query to generate the report and list the department name so you will be given with the two table em employee table and department table okay so out of these two tables what you have to do you have to find the department name total salary of all employee in the department so total salary of the department so basically we will do the group by on department we will get the total salary the average salary within the department so we will use the average function till here it's fine right it's very it seems to be very easy and what we have to find an average salary across the entire company not within the department entire table so for that what we have to do finding like as we have discussed first we have to join the department table and the employee table so i have taken the employee table over here and i have joined with the department on the condition like both employee table department id and department table uh, department id after that what we have to do we have to do the group by because we have to find the department name department's total salary and department's average salary right till here it's fine like it seems to be very easy we have to just use the uh, function and another thing what we have to also find the average salary of all the table so average salary is this right all the table how we will accommodate this in within this query because we have to not find individually we have to find in within one query so how we will do there is two method what we can do we can simply utilize this sql queries this queries we can put into the bracket over here just start the bracket sql used to give this functionality and we can just paste over here as company average company average salary okay not then what we i'll tell you one more thing so if you we'll do like this we can see we we have got the company average salary as well as department salary so department total salary is this department average salary is this and company average salary is this another one method more like we can keep this into the temp table and from there we then again we have to do the same 